Hey guys, it's Austin here from Mountain Entertainment. Just had to make sure it was recording. I haven't used this camera in a while. And I got these little fluff ball things on the top to reduce wind noise. Which might be great for today because it's like cold and windy out. I don't know if it's actually windy. I can't tell. But I finally got something. I got, if you guys know what this is, it's a dash camera. It's a Bava, or I think that Bava? I don't know how you say that. It's a Bava dash cam. I'm not sponsored by these people. I just got a 40 per, or forty dollars off of it, and it's like 49 or 149 dollars on Amazon. <coughs> I saw this on Street Beats, Street Speed 717's video. So let's open this up real quick. Let me figure this out real quick. That should work. All right, so when you open it, it's like this, this little thank you uh, letter saying thank you for buying our product. Um, little instructions I'll take out with me. Um, then I think this is just the user guide, which I don't think I really need, but I might. Shows you how to run it through your car. Or truck like I am doing all right so when you open it or remove that little thing you got one two three boxes okay sorry about that but when you open it up there's three little tabs I went over that so you got to pull the first one out to get to the good stuff so this is the camera it's that size crazy um, I've already opened this one or the camera to see it <clears throat> but it's got this really nice little protective film on it and then this is the camera little square circle um, that mounts like that then the plug and then that's the lens right there so then it has our little logo on it then the second box is this little snapshot button I don't know if I'm gonna use this honestly um, because I don't know where I would put it well but this is like some adhesive it looks like to clip it to something I don't even know where this plugs into it might be remote yeah it might be remotely huh but it's like a remote uh, uh, so like if there's like something going on if it's I think it records all the time I don't have a, oh, I do have one um, you just press it and it'll either start a new one or take a picture of what's going on I think I'm not really sure about that. Then in here is the cord, the mounting, and the little plug, which I'm not going to use the little plug. I got one in my truck that has two. But they give you this little pry tool to get the wires up in the, um, behind, or pull panels and stuff. I actually have panel pullers, but I don't think I'll need them. And then here's the, I'll go over the wire with you guys here in a second, too. Uh, here's a little plug it just goes just kind of snaps in there like that and that's how it looks when it's in the vehicle oh, that's actually really strong um, it has GPS tracking on it which is actually kind of nice uh, I don't know if that sticks to your windshield or what because that's the plug for the camera then this is supposed to run through the down the Thing. We'll figure it out once we get out there, but I'm gonna go get everything ready, get this all packaged back up to take it out there. I'll put this back in still, but I'll be right back.
Okay, guys. Oh, the lighting is probably not all that great out here. I do got my windows down for this, though. So, the little SD card goes in this little piece right here. So I'm gonna... Someone's shooting, it sounds like. Take this 128 gigabyte one I have and put it in there. I think this will work for this one, but I'm not sure if I'll need to go with the smaller one. Because um, I know some things don't uh, come or work with these, so I'll work with those cards. That is a 128 gigabyte extreme, so it's meant for like GoPros and stuff like that. I got Keegan here with me. I got my puppy, my best friend. She's in here with me. So, we're going to be mounting the, yeah, up here somewhere. I'm not sure where yet, but I'm going to actually try to figure out where to run the wires real quick. So, I'll be right back with you guys once I figure that out. Okay, guys, so I got it all mounted up and ready to go, basically. So, stupid geese. I got it mounted right here on the passenger side of the mirror, or the, yeah, the rear view mirror. So you can't, I'll go on that side, but if you're sitting here, you can see it. But I have the wire ran up, oh, that came out. So I have the wire ran up here, it goes along here, then here's a little GPS box. That's kind of hard for you guys to see, but there's a little GPS box it comes with, and then this wire goes out. It, so this wire right here, that's right back here. You guys can't really see that. Let me get a light on it. Okay, so that little wire right here goes all the way this way, goes that way. And then this wire goes up, back up, around the pillar here. And then it goes down into here. And the wires ran... It's kind of hard to see, but the wires ran right there. I think that, yeah, right there. Oh, you guys can't see that. It's right there. It's hard to see. Focus camera. It's right there. That wire right there, I believe. I think that's it. Can't really tell. But that runs all the way down. So it runs all the way down. Then it pops out here for a little bit. Okay, hang on, let me close this back up before I forget. So it runs all the way down this pillar here. And then I have it going into the glove box where I have this cord for my, uh, since I have a new stereo in here, they mounted the uh, USB in here. So I was gonna have it mounted right there, but I decided to just run it in the the glove box so it can be hidden and then all the extra wires just hidden back here um, you do I do have a lot more extra wire left I could possibly splice that all up and stuff but I think it works like that so there's actually a Vava app for their camera I don't have it connected but as you can see this is one of the pictures it took I accidentally took it but yeah. So with this button, I brought zip ties out here because I thought I was going to need them, but I guess not. So, with this button, I think I'm going to just mount or place it in the uh, center console. Just to have it, I guess. I think I could mount it to my keys with that little loop it has, but I think it'll be fine just to set it in there. And forget about it kind of thing. All these are from work because I eat in my truck uh, when I have lunch and stuff. So, yeah. So, if I ever catch anything, I'm going to share it with you guys, possibly. So, that's what it looks like. And from the outside, looking in, can barely see it. I don't know if you guys can see it. Try to zoom in. Yeah, you guys can barely see it on the camera. It's kind of well blended in there. Because I've seen people that have it like mounted in the middle of their thing, which is kind of stupid. Because I'd rather people not see it. But it's in there and it has a little light on it to tell you when it's recording, I guess. 
So, that is- Okay, so I forgot to put this in the video because it was cold out there and I wanted to get inside. So, oh, I'm, so I'm not affiliated with these guys or whatever, but I'm sorry I didn't do a really in-depth install on it. I just kind of sat it in there, ran wire. Nothing really- it wasn't very easy to record anyways, if I was to record it, because I had to hold the liner, push the wire in, and pull panels, or like, pry pa panels really. I didn't really have to pull any panels off to run the wire, which was nice. just had to pull that weather stripping off, which isn't a big deal, it just like slips off and slips back on. Um, but I'll try to remember to leave a link to the Amazon link, and I'll try to remember um the discount code so if you guys want to get a discount code i don't get anything i don't think because I, it was from street beat 717's video that i found this camera and uh he had a code so i don't know if it affiliates him or it gives him money or whatever i don't think it does because it's vava cams or something i'll leave a link or uh the code in the uh description and all that but i don't think it helps either of us but yeah, I think he just got it for free and or something. But if you buy it with the code, you get forty dollars off, and it's a hundred and forty-nine dollars, I think. And I got it for a hundred and nine dollars shipped to my door off of Amazon. So I'll try to remember to leave all that stuff down in the description. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.